Jeff Doe says, what's your opinion of Nick and his armies of supporters? Ah, oh, you know, I've been commenting for, for my whole life on YouTube on this. Um, the, the thing is that Nick has been attacking me without reason. Uh, I participated to the elevation of this guy uh, in the public eye. Uh, I remember him sending me personal messages saying, JF, wow, when you invite me on your shows, when you invite me on Warsky Live, and when you invite me on the public space, I gain so much followers. It's awesome. It's good for my business. Let's keep it going. And, and it, you know, the, this was a recognition in private by him that uh, that there was some use to him in our relationship. But as soon as as I took my own direction in terms of expressing my thoughts, and I I I never against him, you know, I I didn't complain against him, but he started insulting me personally and then attacking my family. So that that's that's the history of me and Nick, uh, and so I, I I took pleasure in in seeing his failure, because he's been dismissing me for optics reason. People will remember that Nick started insulting me when I started having David on my show as a guest. And his point was, it's not good optics to have this particular intellectual on your show. And that was so childish to me because I knew, I knew Nick and I knew that there would be a day where Nick would have worse optics than me. By the way, my bank account has never been neutralized by the anti-terrorist force of the US or Canada or any country. By the way, I've not been covered in the way Nick was covered, suggesting that he was actively participating to terroristic actions. So, as of today, Nick has worse optics than me. And you know what he would have had to do for me to be supporting him today unconditionally and showing love and appreciation for him? The only thing he could have done is not insult me and attack me on optics consideration but if you choose to dismiss and punch on your right and you choose the optics route and you show yourself unable to even by your own standard be optical then i will take pleasure in your failure today nick is neither an important intellectual nor even an important commentator nor does he have any contribution to the advancement of our understanding of anything. And so what do we have left? An isolated streamer pursued by the American government as a terrorist, excluded from the banking system, for a guy who complained against my optics. What's up, Nick? How is it to have half a million dollars of your money held by the government, by the federal government. And what's the optics of that? That's my view of Nick. Jeff Doe says, I didn't know any of this. That's sad. I saw a video of you and him with that porn star, and I thought you guys were friends. Well, that was, that was back in the days where Nick wasn't insulting me, you see. Uh, Carnival says, Jeff, Nick spent years attacking everyone without reason. Even those who were neutral, even the supportive, he got what he deserves. Lessons for everyone to take heed. Yeah, and you know, it, you have to cross a high threshold to annoy me. It's like you can complain on all of my ideas, you can complain on my book, you can say JF is a pseudo-intellectual, all he says is crap. That's all good. But when you start attacking me on considerations of optics, you're you are essentially deceiving your crowd. That, that's been my problem with Nick's approach. It's that this guy is making a bunch of children believe. This guy is like the Disney of the right wing. He, he's, he's telling cute stories to his children audience. 
the and he's deceiving them into thinking that he's some kind of master of optics. But I knew that I knew the system in which the meat grinder of the public media. And the problem is anyone who speaks about optics is essentially giving credence to the enemy. And I don't I take this very seriously because you are fooling a bunch of right wing people into thinking that uh, if they just wear the right tie or the right suit, it's going to be OK. There's a, the wave of smearing will not come and see how that worked. How, how did that go for you, Nick? How's that suit doing now? Well, it's your last suit because all of your money has been neutralized by the Fed. And now you have nothing. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Dolphin. Remember to like and subscribe.